Photography is not a suspicion. Maybe you should learn that law. Okay. You're an investigation. I am. That's what counter surveillance. No, it can't. Yes, it can. No, it hence, can't. Hence the word surveillance. Mm. It can be confiscated during suspicious activity like... Okay, 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 okay. You want to confiscate it? Try it. Let's go there. You need to stay back six feet. Let, let's go there. You're refusing? You can't give me a lawful order. Are you refusing? Okay, Nicely. now this is funny because I already have video of being walking down here and nobody bothered me. You guys are violating my rights. This is freedom of the press and freedom of the speech. Oh my God, you guys are so ridiculous. Yeah, but you can't turn it off. So make sure, uh-uh, loosen them, that's too tough. I got some female cop. I don't answer questions. You don't need to turn I your. I want to make sure I know why you're setting off an alarm. On the I computer. was over there when the alarm went off, and I could show you on tape. Okay. So whoever car that is, tell them not to hit their alarm because somebody's out here walking around. All right. Well, just make sure you're not touching the cruisers. I can touch them. They're ours. Like really, you think like someone can't touch a cruiser? They're paid for by the city. The police are... Is there something that you? Don't need? give me, don't give me illegal directives. Why do you gotta be so mean to the cop? Like, she's literally being nothing but polite. Okay, guys, so pretty much this dude was doing a fraud at a police station and someone's car alarm started going off, so this female police officer was reacting to it. And this guy immediately is, like, freaking out for no reason. You don't have to talk to a cop like this, especially a female. And I've never seen a frauder touch another person's police car like that and put his hand on it. That's absolutely ridiculous. Why would you have to touch the police cars, dude? That's... If you if you touch the police car wrong way, if you hit it or punch it, that's literally a dent, and that's vandalism. I can touch them; they're ours. Like really, you think like someone can't touch a cruiser? They're paid for by the city. Like someone can't touch a cruiser? They're paid for by the city. The police Is there something that you don't need? give me? Don't give me illegal directives. Are you are you looking for something? Does did I ask for you? Did I go in there and ask for anybody? If I needed assistance, I would go in there. The number's still 911, right? 4425-7701. Okay, did I call? Uh, apparently you did. No. Just tell whoever set their alarm off. They're funny. Now y'all gonna call the cops like you're all cute. I'm standing right at a police station. I don't have to call the cops. I am the cops. Exactly, which is stupid. So why don't you get them for whoever set their alarm off? Why don't you get them for whoever set their Exactly, which is stupid. So why don't you get them for whoever set their panic alarm off? You're the one that was around at me. I was over there. I got it all on tape. Okay. Do you need anything? Did I ask for anything? Yeah, a Big Mac and some fries would be good. How about you go get it? I would like a large Coke with that. That's about all you guys are good for anyway. Fucking idiot. It's plumb stupid. Couple more idiots. Can I get your name and badge numbers since y'all want to come out here? Chris Kelly. That's about all these cops are good for. Do you frauders have any idea what these cops do on a day-to-day -day basis? They put their lives in risk every single day to try to protect the community. They're not taking orders from McDonald's. Like It's way bigger than these frauders think, guys. You're at a police department. You're causing a disturbance at this point. Uh, another person's car alarm was going in the parking lot, the same parking lot that you're in filming and going up and touching people's cars. I, would be, I wouldn't be surprised if this dude doesn't end up getting arrested and leaving in handcuffs. Numbers, since y'all want to come out here, Chris Kelly, what's your badge number? 361. Can I get your name and badge number? Well, I don't see your badge number. 911 is my badge number. What if people can't read? Aren't you supposed to be professional? No, he probably can't read or write because most of these frauders are stupid. They don't even know they're left from right. They definitely no, don't know public property from private property. You can't read. Aren't you supposed to be professional? Hello. Hello. Do you, need, do you need anything else? No, I don't. I was yeah. just walking around the police station, which is my right. 
Somebody set off their alarm. Why don't you go talk to them? Because when I came out, I seen you walking along. I was right there when it went off. I was over there. Okay. Would you like to go watch the tape? Look, Mr. Frauder, it doesn't matter where you're at in this police parking lot. Someone's car alarm went off and you're the only one out there with a camera. You look suspicious as hell and these cops are definitely going to go up and talk to you and most likely detain you because of your suspicious behavior. You're not fooling anybody here, buddy. Would you like to go watch the tape? Do you need to file a police report or anything? Not at the moment. Okay. Well, I mean, if I wanted to file a report, I wouldn't be standing out here with a video camera. I would walk in there, but while we're on the subject, maybe you can go tell the chief of police to give me a call back since I've waited two days. And they won't let me make an appointment to talk to him. Trust me, the chief of police has much more important things going on in the city than talk to you, buddy. And they won't let me make an appointment to talk to him. So... Have you tried emailing him? Yeah, and I've emailed him over two times and no response. Oh, so a I'm thinking... Person. He's very busy. I'm sure he will get back with you as soon as he gets time. The emails was two, over two weeks ago. Okay, like I said, he has a whole city... It takes five minutes to, to, to email. Is it anything I can assist you with? No. Okay. So you gonna stand out here the whole time I record? No. Waste taxpayers' monies with your Just vehicles running? Making sure nobody was breaking into this cruiser. That's about it. So someone with a video camera looks suspicious. In today's age, yes. Especially in today's when, age? Yes. Especially yes. When, when are you got... Oh, right. wow. In today's age, yes. Is it illegal? Is it illegal? No, but it is suspicious. Is okay. it a misdemeanor or a felony? Uh, it is suspicious. I didn't say it was illegal. Photography is not a suspicion. Maybe you should learn that law. Okay. You're an investigation. I am. That's what they say. You're an investigation. I am. Photography isn't suspicious, but imagine you're... You're, imagine you're someone who doesn't know about First Amendment frauders. Imagine you're someone who doesn't even know about YouTube. You're a police officer. You're working your job. You're on duty. You're working at the library. You're working at the post office. And someone comes in with a camera recording you. That's suspicious behavior. That's automatically suspicious. That's weird. That's not normal. People don't know what that is. Not everyone in the world knows what a First Amendment fraud is. It's suspicious behavior. So yeah, photography is suspicious. You're going around recording police cars, license plates, inside car windows. Those cops might not even know what a First Amendment fraud is. That's suspicious. What don't you frauders understand about that? Do you not get that through your guys' head that not everyone knows what this is? You're an investigation. I am. That's what they say. <coughs> photography is not a crime. And it cannot be condemned a crime. But also it could be construed as counter surveillance. No, it can't. Yes, it can. No, it hence, can't. Hence the word surveillance. Mm. Okay, during suspicious activity like Okay, okay, okay. You want to confiscate it? Try it. Let's go there. You need to stay back six feet. Let, that, let's go there. Virus Tr now. Try and take my camera. Okay. Better go get a Dude, this is not the first frauder I've seen do this. Why do you guys think it's a good idea to step close to police officers and scream in their face? That's a terrible idea. I guarantee this guy regrets doing that later in this video. Let, let's go there. Virus Tr town. Try and take my camera. Okay. Better go get a search warrant. Okay. Get a search warrant. I think you all need to go back and learn some education. No, it's not. The, the, the parking lot is. No, it's not. It does not say no unauthorized personnel, and that's the this, that's this, the entrance door. Need, this this is funny. You guys are gonna look so cute on YouTube again. If you want, you can go up top. Go no, because I can go right in that door right there. So I'm allowed to walk can. here. You exactly. You can go in the lobby. Right there. Or you can go up top. This is a restricted no. right there. This no. is police cars and. Personnel Unless you got only. the no personnel parking, I'm not parking. Okay, I'm not in a car. Okay, but, it you, says, but, but you are around police cars and you need to get up top there. You need to leave this Our tax dollars pay for them, and you're okay. gonna tell me this. Yeah, this okay. is the second request to leave this lot. Right? I'm not leaving. I'll leave when I'm done with my story. Okay. This is the third and final request to leave Good. the restricted parking lot. Are you, are you refusing? You can't give me a lawful order. Are you refusing? Wow. 
They gave you three or four chances to leave the restricted area. You have four or five different cops telling you, this is a restricted area, you can't be here. And you want to sit there and argue with them and say, oh no, there's not no signs. How are you going to tell them? This is their police department. There's five of them telling you this is a restricted area. You have to leave, sir. And you're going to sit there and argue with police officers. Let's see what happens and how that turns out for you, buddy. My story. This is the third and final request to leave Good. the restricted parking lot. Are you refusing? You can't give me a lawful order. Are you refusing? I'm allowed to write a story. You guys do realize you don't have signs. Yes, we do. Reserve police vehicle. It doesn't say unauthorized personnel. On top of the circle, there is a sign that says that. No, it says authorized vehicles only. It doesn't say anything about a person walking down here. Okay, now this is funny because I already have video of being walking down here and nobody bothered me. You guys are violating my rights. Okay. This is freedom of the press and freedom of the speech. Oh my God, you guys are so ridiculous. Yeah, but you can't turn it off. So make sure, uh-uh, loosen them, that's too tight. I already got bruises from a week ago. You guys catch that? He's got bruises on his hands from a week ago from getting arrested. Wow, you got arrested last week and you got arrested again. How many times has this guy been arrested? And right off the rip, he requests double cuffs. That reminds me of my long enemy CRA audits requesting double cuffs like a little girl every time he gets arrested. Let's pull up a couple clips of CRA requesting double cuffs like this guy. They must know each other. I need double cuff, please. Please, please, please. I need double cuff. I need double cuff, please. That's too tight. I already got bruises from a week ago. Double cuff, please. 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 Double cuff, He's got mace in his pocket, guys, which you don't know. I think it's another word for pepper spray. That's what these frauditors use to def claim defend themselves when people assault them or approach them. And I'm going to be doing some reaction videos soon to some frauditors pepper spraying people because I had a couple subscribers mention Amendment Press. He likes to pepper spray old women, which is complete bullcrap. These guys should be arrested for this, guys. It's unnecessary and it's not right to pepper spray and tase innocent people who are just approaching you because they're nervous about a camera. So it doesn't surprise me one bit that this frauder has pepper spray in his pocket because he's ready to pepper spray somebody for views and clout. I don't have no guns. <coughs> I know you can't come down here with that. I do have cash in there, so don't touch it. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and hand you that cash. You can't even arrest me for this. this is I have to make sure. Right. Oh my god, you got this. Oh boy. Okay, let's go this way. You guys just Can you it. lock down? You guys just Dude's been handcuffed for like a minute now and he still wants to argue with the police. You finally went right, blah, blah, blah. You're going to jail, buddy. You're trespassing in a police parking lot. There's no arguing your way out of it now. Just roll with the punches. You put yourself in this position. They gave you five chances to leave. You can't 
Tell me to go home. You are. Oh my. Don't make it a story. You're a kid trapped inside a grown man's body. Is what you are. I'm not a kid. Well, have a seat there for me, okay? Have a seat. No. All right. Well, you're gonna need to sit down because you're gonna need to take your shoes off here in a second. Why don't you take my shoes off? Because that's I'm part of the take, process. Uh, these off of you? Yeah. This lady knows me. Mm -hmm. So they're trying to tell me I can't video record. I can't. Can't video record from inside the circle. We were told you you could go out top and you could stand there outside. There is no sign that says. Okay. okay. I need your jacket off. We're going. You'll be changing. This. You got a shirt under that. Yeah. All right. Uh, any Can I make a phone call on my phone real quick? No, you're gonna have to make one from ours when you get a chance. You guys won't let. Dude hasn't even got to jail yet. He's literally just in the processing room, whatever. It's for 30 seconds. Says, Can I make a phone call real quick? Bro, you haven't even got went to jail. That's hilarious. Like, can I make a phone call? Any can I make a phone call on my phone real quick? You know, you're gonna have to make one from ours when you get. Look, this guy's such a little girl. He probably see received so much backlash from this video. He disabled his comments. This was posted on September 17th, 2021. By I know my rights. If you guys want to go check out his, the this fraudster's channel, you guys won't let me. Let me make a. But yeah, guys, I'm Big West Frauder Watch. I just want to say I appreciate you guys so much, especially if you watch the video all the way through the end. I highly encourage you guys to watch my videos through the end so you get the full story. Thank you guys so much for watching another video. I have three other videos published on my page, two short videos and two live streams. Make sure you go check out all those videos. If you haven't seen them yet, guys. I'm Big West Frauder Watch. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Make sure you smash the like button, comment, share, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give me some honest feedback in the comments and let me know what you think. This is my fourth ever uh, Frauder reaction video, so let me know what you guys think. I'm Big West, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.